Hey, what's going on? This is Code Name Ace, and we're here in the Ark. We're back in what do you call this? Dynamon Stadium. We're gonna do a couple things here. Just go through a couple things before we get set up. Before, well, before the buildings finish, actually. So I've kind of made an addition back here. This is right now the Pokemon Breeding Center, where I, I may need someone to kind of take this over. Like, people would come and drop off your Dynamon. <laughs> I don't know what kills you, this ain't Dynamon. But you come drop it off, um, you kind of unclaim it. This person would have to be trustworthy. You'd unclaim it, and they would claim two others, or like, you'd claim two, and then they can breed them for you. Kind of raise them. We have fridges here. We have, well, you see, the problem is, unless you unclaim them, you can't really use this. And technically only I could use this or someone in my tribe so we'll have to figure out something to do with that and it's getting really dark and then now I've realized there's no light in here we got AC's galore what I might do is if you want you can leave your dino in here and come have a seat and kind of breed them in here this would be a pretty good place to do it get it but yeah there's tons of AC's it took me quite a while actually and gestation period. Okay. I don't know how long that is, but their mating is finished. All right. Maybe I made a bad eye. I'm bad decision. We might also have to get light because it is pitch black in here. Well, not pitch black. It's green. But if I go in here. This is kind of Pokemon trainer room or area. I can't see a thing. But night on this game is very short. So if we wait a couple seconds, we should be able to see again. Or I could just do this. There we go. Take out the, the, the flashlight. Uh, take out the flashlight. There we go. So this is basically where if you're a trainer, you can come in here and you'll get a room. And this is for like trainers, like people who are winning the battles. I, I think, I think there's like 12 in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, there's 12. I think that's enough. I don't know. I don't think there's a lot of people going to be playing. Who knows? Maybe no one will play, but we'll see. So you kind of get a room. And when you win, you kind of get upgrades. Put a fridge in here. I don't know if you can put a bed in here, technically, because it's on my stuff, so you can never really spawn in here. You can get a fridge, get a chest, keep some stuff in there. Yeah, maybe that'll work. But yeah, if you're a trainer, you're gonna leave your stuff in here. It's a safe place to leave it. Not overnight, like just when the tournament's going on. If you have multiple, you can come and drop them all off so you have them all here when the tournament's going on. And we may build like a underbuilding underneath. That's kind of like a dino catcher. You can see how far it's moved. Wow, it's gonna be forever. So yeah, it's gonna be like a dino catcher underneath the building. So it's a lower part. So you can see it's not a big deal of what was added, or a big deal of what was added. It's not really a big deal, not something elaborate. It's just an extra room. But on top of it, we're gonna build something else, like right up into the sky. Kind of starting from here, and then going over and going up. A tower. And we'll go through that later. But yeah, this was basically just to do the, just to check out the dino breeding room. There's nothing special. There's something here. And these guys, they bred already. I just kind of caught them to see if you can carry them. And you... What the heck? Why am I holding it like that? That's not how you hold them. Okay. 
Usually you pick them up like like that, yeah. You hold them by their tail. This is normally by how you hold them. All right, so right now we'll have to get berries to feed them. Which will be at my Brontos. Oh. And you did see this earlier. Kind of a beginning thing. Is I went and I tamed a Dun Beetle. Right there. I tamed him. It's a really low level one. I just like found him. Let me see how easy it is to tame them in the caves. So I went there and grabbed one. Grabbed one. There we go. So yeah, I'm gonna grab some berries. Come back. Ooh, I'm thirsty. Oh, let's just take a load in. I'm running faster than my computer can load stuff. Oh. Let's jump on this guy. Swing my tail like two times. 700 purple berries. Another 97. Another 124. over. I don't know if they need purple berries, like if it's just purple berries they eat. But it will come in handy for like making kibble and things like that. It's so bright. I'm turning the bloom down. Like crazy bright. What if caps matter? gestation period. So I had to come outside and start training him. Tra oh. No, not collect berries. Attack. So I found the best way to do it is to go into your um, what's it called? Your spyglass. And then use cave vision in it. So you go into K-Vision and you select your spyglass and you kind of do a crazy zoom in. Looks amazing. It's like a way to get a close up look. Well, pretty much anything without getting the, the kind of circle of the glass from the spyglass. You just kind of get a zoomed in look. It looks really good. Good way to take photos too. Pokemon Snap. So there he is. Let's battle. Oh, he got wrecked. Are you eating him? Oh, I heard one. Gonna be my friend? Huh? Where'd he go? 
Is it match? Oh, came back. Hello. There's a crazy zoomed in look at it. You wanna be my friend? Or you wanna battle? So strong. There's three of them. Let's see if you can take them. Oh, whoa, level 27 male? I should catch you. Oh, try to bite me. Whoa, try to jump on me. What we could do is we can actually also. him like we did the last one. Like how we did the... The Heracross? Which one is he? The 27 Levi. Alright, let's go! <laughs> there you go! <laughs> Bring it back home. And where is it? So this is how you you tame them. You use the the dino decks. You hit them on the head. Don't run. Come. And you hit them until they go to sleep. And then you catch them. <gasps> I killed it! Yes, so when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. So don't use the dino decks to hit them because they're not strong enough to, well, they don't get enough to pour per hit. You'll end up killing it. But guess what I found? Oh, whoa, it's like, I found an even higher level one, not 30. So it's not the best, but it's way better than anything I already had. And then this way you just, the gun butt, should be enough to knock it out. What? Go to sleep. Hey, you know what? I got some trank arrows for Mr. T Rex. There you go. And all the prime meat is spoiled. Damn it, life! Just, just give me lemonade. I don't want lemons. Got level 27, it died. Level 29, knocked it out. But the prime meat spoiled, because I was freaking out about the... Level 27. So, yeah. times. Level 29. It's not... Oh shoot, I don't have the, the prime. No. This prime I had spoiled. I went, oh no. I did it. I, I put it on me already before I went out. I mean, before I went to knock this guy out. Oh, it was only one? Are you serious? It's a unicorn. This is super rare. Trico. Perfect. He'll be undefeated. Unbeatable. Yeah, we caught this one. And we'll put him away. But yeah, um, just use a, a dart and oh, the prime spoiled just now. And just knock him out, cause yeah, they won't die. And it would suck if you had a 30 and you killed it trying to use the dino decks like I did. 
But yeah, we caught all that. We're gonna go, well, we don't have to put them in the room. Cause we don't have a high level female to breed with. So we can't breed that one. But we'll cut back once. Okay. Yeah. We'll cut back once the, I'm dead. Oh, okay.